here with the best places to find it all around town. The woman who knows it all, we have local writer Amanda Serena. It's great to see you. Thank you. It's lovely to see you guys too. I'm always taking a list of all of your items because you, you curate it and you do all the research for us, which I think is really great. Yes, and we always have so many options. So mm -hmm. we're trying to come up with a couple that you guys might not have done already, right? And so one though that is kind of becoming a holiday tradition is going to see the holiday lights in Sugarland. So it's the ninth annual lights there. They have three million lights and wow. 10 different setups. It's really pretty spectacular, but they're also trying to keep it fresh. So they have a new lighting display this year and there's also a big 40 foot tree, all the different photo opportunities. And where in Sugarland is this happening? How do we find it? So it's at Constellation Field. So if you haven't been there before, it's all outdoors. There's a holiday bazaar, a bunch of different things going on. Santa was always there as well. And, and do you buy tickets there or, or online? Either. I, it's best to buy them. I like buying stuff online, yeah. and that way I have a better idea and can kind of save some lines and stuff when I'm getting there. What I think is great, too, there's senior raids, there's military, there's kids' raids, and it's now and through uh, New Year's Day. Yes, and if you don't have plans for New Year's Eve, I know we're thinking way ahead, they do have some fireworks at midnight. Oh, very cool. On New Year's Eve. This is so beautiful. That's very, very nice. All right, and very convenient for a lot of our viewers in the Fort Bend County area. All right, let's talk about Texas Winter Lights, Marriott Marquis downtown. So we think of the Marquee for the big Texas lazy river during the summer, but if you haven't been during December, they also have some light setups down uh, on their patio there as well. And so there's some lights, there's some glowing tree grove, there's also some other, of course, you know, always looking for the Instagram, there's always, uh, <laughs> there's an archway full of lights there as well. And, you know, it can be a happening spot after hours. They have a DJ, a winter menu, and then also for family friendly stuff, a hot cocoa bar. Mm. Oh, very cool. I, I've been there and I love the lights. I think it's very cool. And then if, also, if you want to do a little staycation, there's uh, private access for the hotel guests as right. well. Right. So on the weekends, it's for hotel guests. So, but during the week, you know, we're going to have some days off here soon. Yeah. You can go then. That Get lazy river, it. it looks so nice right it's, now. And, you can go in it. Yeah. It's awesome. Yeah, because it's heated. So it's fantastic. Okay. I was just telling you during the commercial break, Break, Amanda, uh, AJ and I, my son on Saturday did this uh, at Post Houston. If y'all haven't been there, you need to get down there. This is the Winter Wander Lawn. Yes, so the Sky Lawn at Post is becoming one of my new favorite spots, mm -hmm. right? Not only does it have a beautiful views of downtown, but they're doing a great job of just bringing in some fun stuff, and it's free, right? So you can go to the food court down below, get some food, then come up, stroll through the lights, and you know, see all the holiday displays they have up there as well. It is the perfect location to make an entire evening out of it, because as you mentioned, the food court downstairs, you can grab a cocktail, maybe some delicious ice cream after you see the lights and the views. Okay, let's chat about Dasher's Light Snow, or Light Show rather, and Winter Wonderland? Winterland? Winterland. So there's two things happening here. We discovered Dasher's, it's in Humble, so it's a little bit of a drive, but we discovered it during COVID because it was a beautiful drive-through scene where it's got music linked up. You put it in your car, they tell you what to tune it to, oh. and the whole thing is set up so that you take your car through. But now um, they also have this Winterland as well, so you can park and go in. There's some food there, Santa, all of those kinds of things. They're ticketed separately. So the drive-through light show is a per car fee. So you can load it up with however many people you want to load it up with. But if you want to go to the winter land, that is you have to register your vehicle and then it's a per ticket, uh, per person ticket. And then there's some tokens packages. But one good thing for Houston Life viewers is they are offering a discount code. So there, if you do Houston Life as the promo code to do the drive through for the light show, you're going to get 15% off now until December 20th. Okay. okay. I that's, love that. And that's happening at Humble Civic Center. Correct. Okay. Yes. Right. Definitely check that out because it looks amazing. Okay, we have to, this is another great one, and this is sort of a tried and true over at Bearings. Yes, so Bearings is such a wonderful local store here in Houston. There's two locations. It's been here since the 1940s. I love going in there because you're not only going to see, like, your hardware stuff, but yeah. then also, like, Fancy. China and yeah. fancy crystal. and yeah. crystal and all these other things. And they offer a free Santa mm. and he will be here this Saturday in baby. the afternoon. So cute. <laughs> all they ask though is that you bring your own camera, but there'll be a sales associate there to take your picture and you can see, look, it's all ages. Everybody can go see Santa. That's a great idea. And you can do some shopping while you're at it. We love free Santa photos. Last but not least, Santa's Wonderland at the Bass Pro Shop. Bass Pro Shop is my other favorite free Santa. And so they do a wonderful job of decorating.
the whole stores. You can mail your letters to Santa there if you haven't done that already. Get in those last minute requests. And then there is free photos. It's a free four by six. You do need to make your Santa photo reservation online before okay. you get there. And they release appointments a week in advance. So if you're looking for next week sometime, start looking for it a week away from when you're going to hopefully go. Okay, that's a great tip. That is quite a Santa setup right there. By the way, you can get all the info for these events on our website. We have posted a link under the scene on Houston Life section of HoustonLife.tv. Amanda Serena, it's great to see you. It's great to see you too. Happy I can't holidays. believe we didn't acknowledge your antlers. I know. So I was cute. told to bring fun headwear, so well, I did. I stole it from my children. Understood the mission, assignment. Mission accomplished. Nicely done. Thank you, Amanda. Thank Good you to so see much. you.